breakfast done. Kelly, Fiat, Justin, Jez and my mum have just buzzed to come in so they'll be coming here in a second. Kelly and Justin have not seen the flat at all yet, they haven't even seen it from the beginning so I'm so excited to show it to them. Yay! Yay! Fiat! Kelly and Justin and Becky and baby Thea have just left. Now Lucy is trying to be a builder. I'm a builder. <laughs> so basically she's bought this shoe rack because as you saw in the last vlog she has so many shoes. This is from her house. She's trying to put that in there in the bottom of her wardrobe but it's not quite big enough. So she's going to try and modify. So I'm taking out one side and re-drilling the holes. Yeah. So hopefully it will because it's the only bit that sticks out is this bit here. It's a little bit here. So we're thinking if we can just I can get rid of this literally this here, centimetre. Like Do you think it's going to work? Well, yeah, but I need you to get me a drill bit. Like, I thought five minutes ago until I've done it. So it turns out Lucy's a bit of a carpenter. And she's actually gone and done it. Okay, it's now. Oh, sorry. Blimey. Half the size here. You've actually done it. Oh, God, there's a big nail sticking out there. You can hammer that down. That's fine. Ah. Oh. Wait. Oh. Hang on. It was tight before, so it, it was literally been... skin tight. If that's even yes, is that right? it was it's pushing the wardrobe tight. out. No, that's perfect. Good job. Now that everything is pretty much done in the flat, um, anything else is left to do. We've got the floor to go down, but that's not really in our control because we're waiting for people to come around um, 5th of October. Um, then we've also got a few bits to go up, like shelving and things, but they're things that we need like bigger tools for. So Zach's going to come and help us. We can't handle the big tools, so. Uh, Zach's going to come and help us with them on Monday, I think. Um, but I'm away next week. I'm in Reading um, at BMW Academy again on another week's training course. Um, so I'll be leaving George for a week, like he left me, payback time. I'm just sitting here, like, thinking what we've got to do. Like, there's, there's a few more bits to do. There's a few more bits to clean and little things to finish off. But in terms of actual, like, the main parts of the flat, we are pretty much there now, which is, like crazy exciting it's just weird because when i was thinking about moving out i thought oh i might do it and then like a few months later I might be like oh i might want to go back home i don't know i had these thoughts and people have said to me like oh no you never want to go back and i was like oh no i don't know i will see um i never thought i never thought i'd want to go back but i just i didn't think i'd feel this happy here and like at home um and it's just crazy because it's like i can't almost can't get my head around the fact that this is our space and it's not like i finish work and go go to the kitchen, grab my dinner, um, sit and eat it, and then go up to my room for the night. I've this, all these rooms here are ours to be in. Um, you, don't, you don't get disturbed, you don't, it's just, it's so relaxing, just knowing that it's ours and that everything here is from our hard work, and that we have literally been able to do what we want with it, which is amazing. But I literally, like I was saying, I could, I could never move back now, like, literally, I could never imagine not living here now, or not living with George, or if any of you have the opportunity to move out, um, do it. Don't question it. Just do it. It's amazing. Having your own space is just like, like nothing else. I'm absolutely loving it. If you would like to. Comfy. Yes. Good. I'm going to YouTube catch up. You've moved all the pillows. We've got loads of pillows yesterday. Look at them. Ooh. These came with the sofa. We got this one. This one is so super soft. This one. And this is the softest thing in the world. I had about seven Casey Neistat videos to catch up what on. What are you watching? I'm watching Mars Alex. Bar now. Cool. Ah, he's got LED blue lights. Did he copy us? Yeah, he, no, yeah, he copied <laughs> us. We copied him. <laughs> I've made some nachos for lunch, but he doesn't know, so I'm going to go surprise him. The reason why I've had to have the uh, video blog sponsor this. What have you made? Because we're actually all electricians <gasps> here today. Oh, 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 where's my phone? Electric Look at that bad boy. Got the bits of chicken in there, guacamole, salsa, sour cream, chilies, cheese, yum. Guys, I've done it again. Oh, I've done it again. I've got an idea in my head. I did it with this camera, I did it with our big camera. I do it with loads of technology stuff. I want a new lens. It's a Canon 50 millimeter, for those of you interested, 1.8 lens. Um, it's on Amazon. I tweeted it out yesterday actually. It's on Amazon for £90, which I think is really good. So I've just got to 
get her approval. Now we've bought all the flat stuff, hopefully I can so maybe buy nice. myself a teeny weeny little present. And it could make our videos look so good because we're going to start sit down videos again soon. So we can get this lens and make it look really nice, really bright, nice blurry background when we get all our shelves up here and stuff. We think this is going to kind of be our background with the shelves up and stuff like that. Let's find this lens. So it's this lens here. Canon EF 50mm 1.8 STM lens autofocus. Would go really nice on our Canon 70D. I know some of you aren't interested in tech and stuff, but I know some of you are. Let me know if you've got this lens, if you've had an experience with a 50mm, let us know in the comments. I basically need to be persuaded to buy it. Look how cozy you are. It's so nice just to be able to chill in this place now. Everything's pretty much done. As I said, we just need our shelving up there. But we're so, so nearly there. It was so lovely having Kelly and Thea around and Justin and Becky. They're like our first proper guests. My parents come around tomorrow. Yeah, it's amazing. It's great. Right, come on, up. That's enough relaxation time. Stuff to do. Errands to run. So we're heading into town. We've got about an hour the shop before, shop. yeah, all the shops close. Nathan Griffiths is stuck at Yeah. Sorry if this little clip is a little bit shaky. We actually forgot the camera, so we're doing this little bit on the iPhone. Yes. Uh, and it doesn't have like image stabilization and stuff like that. And George has got a really weak <sighs> arm. Yeah, my arm's all shaky. <laughs> we've worked out that after all this stuff, we've probably bought pretty much everything on our list. There's about five more things to get. Yeah, then we're done. Oil drizzler. We're gonna have to end this series soon, aren't we? Yeah, it's kind of sad. The moving in series. Hey. <laughs> they obviously watch us. Um, so we're gonna get a few more bits in town now. We have to actually go and book, we have to go and book um, airplane seats now. Because apparently for our cruise, when we're flying out to Barbados, we're not sat together. We're not sat together. Unless so we're, we're gonna go down to the um, Thompson. Thompson and book some airplane seats. We're back in the car. We are now, we've now got four more trips to do before we can relax tonight. The range to get a lamp. Then we're going to George's house to get rid of these suitcases. That's where we bought our clothes in last night. Lucy um, just discovered yeah. something. I was looking for a pen um, to cross some bits off the list. And um, I went to the glove box to look for one. So I went, you know, inside. These, what are these? <laughs> Foil is cake from Chris Bailey's birthday party. Two weeks ago, was it? Or yeah. one week? Do you remember that big party we went to, that massive house? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. I want to eat it. Let's see what they look like. I'm going to give it a go. Are you sure? It looks very hard. Pass it here. Oh, I wouldn't. Does it smell? It smells a bit funny. What does the other one smell like? They're probably the same as this one. That smells nice. No, don't eat it. Don't, don't, George, George, it's, George, it's, no. It'll be out of date. Let's try, it's let's moldy. just try a little bit. You are disgusting. It's not, it's been heated up and. And we are back. Lucy got all of her Stuff sorted out. She sorted out all her makeup drawers. I'm sure she'll show you at some point. And I have wired up these, not these ones. As I said, those aren't working. We don't know whether we're keeping those yet. But for now, we have got these bad boys wired up to the TV because the internal speaker in that is terrible. So now we've actually got some decent sound. Oh, guys, we're trying to decide whether to go out tonight for a few drinks in town or just chill here. Like, it's our first night where we're kind of... Fish, can you concentrate? Uh, We've got people watching us here and you're just reading memes. Yeah, we're trying to decide if we should go out for a few drinks in Worthing. When you thought you had £7 in your bank account, but find out you actually have £16. Oh, it's pointless saying that if you're not going to try the yeah, photo. Uh, we kind of want to probably bump into a few... The drinks are flowing here anyway. Yeah, yeah, we've got a few drinks going on. So the next clip will either be <laughs> of us out and every about. Every time we're in bed. I know. We forgot to end the Nine, vlog. nine times out of ten, we're in bed. So but the next. Now, can I hear us? Yeah. The next clip will be us out and about in town, having a little drink, or it'll be us in bed, ending the vlog. Well, that's an interesting. Make your predictions now. <laughs> 